Are you guys trying to use your Cronus Zen and you've got this Air, Air 3002 and your Cronus Zen is flashing red at you? In today's video, we're going to fix all the errors and hard reset your Cronus Zen, all right? So I was trying to add some scripts and you guys can see it says failed errors. Here's how you're going to fix all of this, all right? Just press OK, OK, OK on this. First step I like to do is just unplug the Zen from the right-hand side. Simply go ahead and plug it back in, all right? That's going to be step number one. Next, you want to go up here into the device tab once it's connected. Go ahead and hit the reset device button right over here, all right? Go ahead and hit that first. That's going to go ahead and reset your Zen device. Again, mine right now says stacks underflow. So that's the first step is making sure you go ahead and hit reset device. Next thing I like to do is go ahead and hit on factory reset as well. So just go ahead and hit on the factory reset button. So you're going to go ahead and click on that. It's going to just simply go ahead and factory reset your Cronus Zen back to its default setting, all right? So those are the first two steps and they're going to be right over here in your device tab, all right? Once all those are done, simply go ahead and close out of your Zen Studios, okay? Next step we're going to do is call the hard reset, all right? Anytime you get errors on your Zen, the quickest way to fix them is hard resetting your Cronus Zen, all right? To do this, you unplug it from the right-hand side, okay? Next, what you want to do is hold down these two blue buttons on the Zen. You guys can see you're going to hold them down together and then give the Zen power from the top, all right? And again, keep these two buttons held until the LEDs on here go red, green, and blue, aka RGB, okay? Red, green, and blue, you're gonna look for those LEDs here. And again, keep this two buttons held down as you give it power, right? So again, hold down the buttons. I'm gonna show it to you guys, right? Give it power from the top. The other end of this cable is into your laptop or PC, right? Whatever you're using to run the Zen Studios. And look, I'm gonna give it power and keep it held and look for those red, green, and blue, right? Once that's done, you can let go. And now it has been hard reset, right? Make sure it turns red, green, and blue, guys, all right? Once that's done, unplug it from the top because you only need it at the top when you're playing. Right now, we're trying to add scripts, right? So just plug it back into the right-hand side. And then go ahead and open up your Zen Studios one more time. And you can see all errors are gone. Same with all the scripts that I had on my Zen, right? This is like a basically a hard reset. I like to do this every once in a while. If your Zen's giving you errors, that's the quickest way to solve it, right? You can see synchronizing flash air might be happening. That's a good way to solve it as well. And everything works now. So hope you guys enjoyed. Catch you on the next one. Peace and love, everybody.